Hello everyone, Yoshi Chief here, and welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead Episode 2. In the last episode, we've been dodging arrows and trying to fix the fence. Ended up with Larry and co getting back, and now we're trying to search for the bandit's camp. We found it here, and now we'll have to see what lies inside the camp. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. Stay on your guard. Always stay on your guard. Back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tan. We're definitely gonna get ambushed here. I can just tell. What's in the tent? It's probably gonna be a couple of people, maybe. There's only one way to find out. Empty. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Mm. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Bottles. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. That means they are around somewhere. So. What's in here? Nothing. What's in this box? Empty. Lots of empty, lots of empty boxes. Oh, what's he found? Oh no, he just moved it for some reason. Thought he found something. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two nope. sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Kid sized? Okay. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. From the Save Lats Company. Ooh. He found something. What's in the boxes? They're all from Save Lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the Save Lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Mm. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Milk. I think. Yeah, dairy box. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Yeah, well, let's let's take the food back, shall we? <gasps> What's this? It's a what do you find? Camera. A video camera. Let me see that. Maybe it'll have some useful information. Battery's dead, though. Oh. Uh, oh. Or not? Good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Hmm. Yeah, but that's just her thing. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Is that it? Oh no, this a kettle. Just water. Look at trash. Yuck, I don't need that. Nothing else here? This music's quite eerie, isn't it? Let's have a look inside the tent. No one's watching. Let's have a look. Okay. 
bloody bunny. Yee. Oh man. It's inside the bag. <gasps> it's the hell? Don't you fucking move. Oh fuck. Shit. Put your guns down. That... I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Wait. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down! That hat. I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Yeah, take where a did you girl. get her hat? It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her! So what if I did? You stole her from me! What? Is she... What the hell are you talking about? Is she... You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn Put person down the I crossbow. see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on, tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for. Oh. oh. Oh, what the hell? Did he need to do that? God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. Well, looks like she was gonna die anyway. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. But what, what so, did she... That's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. But what did she mean when she said stole her from me? Come on. This is just getting ickier and ickier by the minute. What did she mean? I really hope that that's not the mother or anything, otherwise... Ugh. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. This... This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Missing every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, not this again. Down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. Possibly. And Lee? Don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I should bloody well hope so. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Ah. 
then that is where we'll go first. Yeah. Definitely need to give this back to her. I'm wondering what the climax of this episode will be, because I... We're going to be reaching that, I reckon, soon. There's a storm brewing. Get that barn door open. See what's inside. Well, yeah, she said the cow, didn't she? Lots of license plates. License plates? Plates. Enunciate the T's. Oh, cow. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. Aw. Oh. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. Huh? What's this? What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? Did you? I don't know. Uh, you did. You did, didn't you? First of all, hat. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! You knew I needed it. Well, you did tell me it was a birthday present from your dad. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motorhead who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Hmm. Do you think I... you'll ever have kids? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so, Clem. Not the way the world is now. I just... Uh, I don't think I could do that. Oh. Maybe when the world gets better, then. Maybe. Maybe. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Duh. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. She's pretty. Let's call it a Have duck. I missed anything? No, not really. Mm, it smells funny in here. Like shit, right, Lee? Uh. That's what hey, I said. Don't you swear words, okay? Okay. <laughs> it remembered that. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. How's the cow? Well... Better now we got Doc on the case. Oh yeah. Um, when do you think uh we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. Mama's yep. gonna get back on down. Mama gonna get all right. What's in here? Aha. Uh -huh. Probably where you stuff all the food. Anything here? Nope. Oh, let's... Wonder if I should look through all of them. Oh, there we go. There's uh, another one of those salt liquors, I think. More I hay. Clean the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. That's a good call. Okay. That is a good call. They're just going to be spending the next few minutes checking out store doors for some reason. Oh. Let's have a look. Empty. Oh. Okay. Why is that one empty? Let's have a look in here. Oh. What's... What's in the wheelbarrow? Looks like eh? a bunch of old dirty clothes. 
Ooh, smells pretty foul. Yeah. We won't be going back in that one. Door number five. And it's more slop. It's a feeding trough. Yes, thank you. It's exactly what we needed to hear. And more nothing. Making this whole thing entirely pointless. Now, what's in the door? It's locked. You found it too, huh? What? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Yeah, she's not actually. No, yeah. I'm... I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya. What's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Well, so there's a lock. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... you know... <laughs> oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> well, that's a stereotype of life, if I can call it one. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? I'm going to ask. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hmm. Well, let's... Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Yeah, Come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. enough already. Right. What can we do to distract him? Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Right. So let's go out the barn, then. See what we can find. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, not this. Oh, I managed just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for marrows. If that, that becomes, becomes a problem. A problem. I don't know what I can use to uh, get a little distraction. To be honest, I don't know if I should be really fucking around with uh, stuff like that. Oh. Uh, now. I reckon I'm going to stop here because I reckon I know what to do to get Andy out of here. Um, so next time on Let's Play The Walking Dead, we're going to be creating distractions and seeing what's behind that barn door. 
toodaloos, people.